Yes, guys, I'm showing you something. Mr. Rusa feeding the little chicken because her mommy is dead. So the Rusa take care of her. Anything you throw there, she he feed her with it. The other big chicken, them have to run because he's picking them. But that little one, Mr. Rusa take care of her. Because her mommy died from she was about five days old and the rooster take care of her. The other bigger chicken then pick her up. But Mr. Rooster always feed her. Make sure that she's okay. That is so so nice. The rooster is a loving rooster. Look out for the little chicken. I always feed her. And when night comes, Mr. Rooster take her under the cell and let, make sure she's okay. And then he went, go on the roof. Roost. Go on the tree to sleep. But he makes sure that the little chicken is okay. Can you believe it? That's an hen picking there. Her, her chickens are big, but when Mr. Rusa is there, they all flee because they are beating up the little chickens. So Mr. Rusa pick them, so they have to go and allow Mr. Rusa to feed this little one who is motherless. It's such a touching story. <laughs> oh Lord, can you imagine Mr. Rusa? He's feeding the little chicken. He's the one who is taking care of her. Her mommy died from she was just about five days old or seven days old. And he's Mr. Rusa care for her. Make sure she eats and everything like that. When the other bigger one them come along, he right drive them away because they don't care for the little chicken. They keep picking her. And she can't get to eat. But Mr. Rusa always come, come to our rescue, to rescue her from the other bigger chicken. Yes, guys. So if the Rusa can be so loving and nice to a little chicken, and there are dumb things who cannot talk, much as us who doesn't care for each other, we don't know who our neighbors is sometimes. We don't visit one another to find out if all is well and to knock on each one's door to ask if you have something to eat, are you okay? You know, that's the way God wants us to be, but we are not like that. So when I look at the rooster taking care of this little chicken, it's, you know, see there, guys, he's feeding her. He is feeding her. That mother hen will pick her, but once Mr. Rooster is by her side, Mother hen cannot pick her, it's not her chicken. So she always pick her and the other chicken then pick her about eight of them and can you imagine eight chicken picking one little chicken? Oh my, Mr. Rusa always come to her rescue when feeding time. So the other bigger chickens have to go away until Mr. Rusa finish eating and finish feeding this little one. They can come and eat. <laughs> it's such amazing. <laughs> So amazing, guys, to see a rooster feeding a little chicken. Okay, guys, that's what I want you to see. Is the crowing rooster that I sent to you. Yeah, loving and nice. He makes sure, although he's picking the bigger ones, then, whenever night um, um, come, he's, he, he take them under the cell and let, make sure they are okay, and then he go to his roost. He's so loving and caring. So, so loving and caring. So the little chicken is not afraid of him. He, he's taking care of her from five days old until now. Make sure she's okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Bev Brown. Peace out. Out of here. Love you guys. Remember to like my videos. Share my videos. And guys, I have a problem with some... 
Someone is um keep subscribing more than one time and, and subscribing me. I was at 108 and now I'm at 106. Because someone still, although they subscribe already, they are still subscribing me. Guys who subscribe already, don't care how many videos you see Bev Brown put out, please don't subscribe. Just thumbs up on them, okay? And comment. Thank you, guys. Bev Brown out of here.